in the Edge Malaysia this week. A high court ruling against a unit of CITOS Digital has cast a spotlight on the credit reporting agency's business model. Public opinion has been rife, with people divided over many issues ranging from whether CITOS should be allowed to generate individual credit scores to whether the group should take responsibility for the accuracy of the data generated. CITOS, meanwhile, believes it has a strong case for appeal. But if it fails, what are the broader implications and why does it matter? In our city and country pullout, after trimming its Malaysian portfolio a few years ago and shifting its focus to Australia, Malfa International has plans afoot for its leisure farm township in Johor. CEO Greg Shaw and General Manager Mark Lee share their optimistic outlook for the southern state and the company's venture into hospitality technology. In options, Kome Lee, CEO of Golden Screen Cinemas, takes us on a journey from its humble beginnings to groundbreaking innovations. She also talks about how Golden Screen Cinemas continues to redefine the movie-going experience with RMTRX, Southeast Asia's largest ultra-lux entertainment destination. In our ESG pullout, as more corporations are focusing on diversity, equity and inclusion beyond gender, the hiring of differently abled individuals, whether it is those with mental or physical disabilities, could become more commonplace. Already, programs are being introduced to integrate these individuals into the workplace and assist them along the way. Details on this week's edition of The Edge. Save by subscribing to us for your print and or digital copy. The Edge is also available on Apple's App Store and Android's Google Play.